In the coming days, we will know what the U.S. Federal Reserve plans to do with rates. If, as expected, the Fed decides it's the right time to hike, shock waves will likely reverberate around the world, sucking money back to the U.S. and damaging emerging economies like Korea. For more on the potential impact, Shin Semin reports. Expectations are higher than ever that the U.S. Federal Reserve will start hiking rates this month. If liftoff is announced, it'll be the first time the Fed has raised rates from near zero since 2006. The heightened possibility of an imminent rate hike is weighing heavily on emerging markets, including Korea. For one, the decision could trigger a massive outflow of foreign capital. Market watchers suspect a hike could have an even bigger impact on Korea than originally expected, especially considering other factors, such as the slowing Chinese economy and tumbling commodity prices. With the greenback strengthening, the Korean one will depreciate, possibly accelerating the pace of funds out of Korea. If capital outflow accelerates, it'll put pressure on the Bank of Korea to hike its benchmark rate. But it won't be easy for the BOK to do that, given the nation's massive household debt mountain, which is nearing the $1 trillion mark. Taking a wait-and-see approach, the Bank of Korea this week froze its key interest rate at a record low of 1.5 percent for six straight months. Experts add that instability in emerging markets will deal a blow to Korean exporters who already face long-term difficulties with the slowdown in China. Korea's total exports fell 4.7 percent on year last month, coming in at $44 billion. Exports have fallen every month since the start of the year. Shin Semin, Arirang News.